Hello everyone, it's Kieran from Trilac, BC, Canada. You are watching Trucker Josh Vlogs on TJV. Enjoy the video. Let's start that again. Good morning, friends and viewers. I say friends and viewers because some of you, some of you were mean people. But that's okay, you're welcome here anyways. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think of me. Give me your best shot. We are in uh, uh, North Dakota, but a half hour south of the Canadian border, we're headed north. We're bringing this load of steel that I have behind me that I picked up in Missouri to Manitoba, where we're gonna drop it off I'm gonna go home for a reset, and then on Sunday or the day after tomorrow, I'm heading with a new load out west in Canada. I got a drop in Saskatoon, Calgary, and then I think Surrey, British Columbia, somewhere in the lower mainland of BC, way on the other side of the mountains there in that part of the world. We are ready to go though. Lights are on, pre-trip is done. I've let the world know through my e-logs that I'm good to go. I waved at strangers. They gave me a funny look. Don't people wave at people anymore? What? I had to park way out here on the edge, almost on the off ramp of the of the rest area, because last night I parked, and this truck that obviously had a muffler malfunctioning that needs a new, uh, the truck just needed to be thrown in the garbage. It was so loud, so obnoxious. The engine wasn't running right. It sounded like it was running off like four or six cylinders. They parked right beside me. And it was a warm night, so I had my truck off and I had my windows open. But if I closed my windows, it would get too hot in here, right? So right beside me, kept me up, so I had to move to a quieter spot. But that's okay. It happens to me actually quite often. I like to have a quiet night. Pembina, North Dakota. The gas tracks here just stopped in for a quick coffee. And we're set. Canada is about one mile that way. Ah, oh, yeah. And just like that, work for the day is over. Today was a really short day. We're gonna go home now and uh, install an air conditioner in our bedroom window. I'm really excited to do that because it's so hot already. It's only June and we have this really strong south wind coming from the US right now, blowing all that heat that I was in last week up here. So it's getting hot, hot, hot. So we need a, we don't have air conditioning or central air in our house. We just have one air conditioning unit that's portable that we can move from our dog's room where they stay when we're not home to uh, our main area to keep the main area of the house cool. But we don't have any in our bedroom. And when there's me and Britt and three big dogs, two big dogs and one, one dog who's big in heart, the little wiener dog, Frankie, when we're all in the same little bedroom together, it gets really hot at night. So we've got an air conditioner for that room now. Got to install it tonight and that should be fun. Let's go home and do that. I've already dropped the trailer. It's just me in the truck right now. Uh, we already got our load details here for our next load. We are ending up in Surrey, BC. Three drops, one in Saskatoon, one in Calgary, one in Surrey, BC, like I said. And then we have a reload at the same place in Surrey, BC, taking us back to Owatonna, Minnesota. That'll take up the entire next week and a little bit. That's good. Okay. Let's go home. Oh, oh yeah. Potatoes. Chicken. Oh, 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 oh. It is so hot out here right now. It's like plus 35 Celsius out here. It is. My shirt melted right off of me. It's hot. It's very hot. I burned within five minutes of being in the sun. I'm still burning. I'm pink. So, we've got them a little black, but they're going to be juicy. It's going to be so good. Got some taters over here. Only for you, though, not for me. Woo! Hot. I think they're cooked. Everything's so hot. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, that's what you did. Yeah. Thank you. Yes, you're welcome. And the asparagus is going in the microwave and the steamer right now. Mmm, that looks good. Taters for you, not for me. I can't, well, it's not that I can't eat these, but I don't. 
and I'm down almost 15 pounds because of it. She has been losing a ton of weight. She's lost like two small children already. <laughs> Very small children, newborn babies. Mm -hmm. I've, I've lost almost 15 pounds, uh, giving up bread, pasta, rice, basically like all those empty carbs, donuts, pastries, um, yeah. and not even exercising. So I'm good just, job. I still eat ice cream and chocolate. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's looking good. Thank you. And here is the air conditioner that we bought that we're going to be installing in our bedroom. I'm really looking forward to that, actually. It's kind of cool. Felt like Christmas time when I went to go pick it up. <laughs> I always like getting new toys and stuff, especially if they're useful. And this is the air conditioner I was telling you about before that's portable. Uh, you see, it blows the cold air out here and it vents out here i've got a new vent for the back of this over here now which is pretty much the exact same thing right here and i'll explain that in a little bit but uh this little air conditioner is a 5000 btu if that means anything to you good for you it's going to be going in uh our bedroom here so we've got a very small bedroom and uh our our, well, our master bedroom is here but we're remodeling it very slowly. So you remember we used to sleep in there and then they got this area over here and then this big bathroom in the center of the whole bedroom, right? We're knocking out this bathroom, we're moving it off to one side so that we can have a much bigger master bedroom instead of like, you know, just that little space there and this little space here. This is my office now it's a, and slash storage room. But uh, once this is all remodeled, this will be our master, master bedroom and ensuite here. But for now, while we're trying to get started on that, this is where we're sleeping in this room. So when I'm at home with me and Britt, the two big dogs, plus Frank in here, it gets pretty warm in the summertime. So this window unit is going to be going in here. And so I've got to fit it in there. I've got to cut out a piece of plywood to cover up the, uh, Know, the extra space and then I've got to seal it all and uh, cut a piece of wood for in here so that the window can't open any further than we need it to but it'll keep this whole room in here very cool for us and Britt and I both like it to be freezing cold while we sleep or we don't sleep very well yes, even in the sir. truck it has to be cold and for that other piece that I bought there before you see this cools down our main area right now or struggling a little bit next year we'll probably get another window unit like this for that window there and then that will just stay in the dog's room but for now we move that between the main room here and the dog's room which is half of the soon to be master bedroom a little confusing i know this is the dog's room here i don't know why this is here like this but these this is their area in here and uh i bought that piece that i showed you there that's going to go into the side of the window here see we got one little piece that we sort of made ourselves in there right now that's going to replace that and then when we leave the house and we need to leave the dogs in here because we don't let them have full reign of the house while we're gone there was an incident so they've lost their privileges so then we need this room to remain cool right so we need to have the air conditioner in here so we roll it from the main area in here and then we can just hook the exhaust right up to the window which will already be set up for it it'll be super easy it'll take five seconds and then this room stays cool for them so it's gonna be a hot summer from what we've heard and so far it's not even summer yet and it's really hot and speaking of hot 35 degrees only june 7th yep i'm gonna have to let you guys go i've got uh, work to do <laughs> look at these huge asparagus really I know. That's it's the like book. They fed them steroids. They're probably wow. not natural. Those are like bamboo plants. Yeah, Look at this huge. I even cut off the thicker part. Wow. All right, it's time to eat. I will talk to you guys later when we're trying to install that. Should be interesting because I have no idea what I'm doing. So, for above the air conditioner, I'm going to have to cut out a piece of plywood here, cover up the rest of the hole in the window. 26 inch by 15 inch. Well, 
Almost got it installed. Oh, we have it installed. It's in. I just have to screw it into place, make sure that it can't move. And we got air conditioning in there. <laughs> Should turned out pretty good. We're gonna have a nice cool night tonight. There it is from the inside. I think that's gonna look pretty good. So I'm gonna I'm just gonna screw it into place so that it can't move and give it a test. All right, got it plugged in, got it mounted. Now to test it. High cool. Feels pretty good. That's glorious. It's not too cold yet, but we'll give it a few minutes. Right on. Watch out, Diesel. Diesel. Thank you. That is going to be so nice. Much better. Last summer, I swear we didn't even sleep. No, we didn't, we just so hot. Hello, this is Morgan and Sean. We're from Great Falls, Montana. Uh, we love watching Trucker Josh vlogs. Don't forget to subscribe.